everybody welcome back to, to the kitchen here for another episode of what's cooking with the bear today we're gonna do uh, my take on French bread pizza uh, got all the ingredients here it's gonna be uh, mushrooms and pepperoni and onion or no sorry no onion don't have any onion tonight uh, got some anchovies pizza sauce but the thing I start out with right off the bat is I use frozen garlic bread just take a loaf of the garlic bread split it open still frozen take some pizza sauce dump a liberal amount of that on there kind of spread her out somewhere Once you got that done, pepperoni, of course a liberal amount of pepperoni, get this one laid out here. Got the pepperoni on there, some mushrooms on here. I was gonna make this the other night while we were doing the uh, New Year's Eve live stream, but uh, I had too much going on and decided not to do it. If you guys haven't checked that out, go check that video out. That was a pretty good live stream. Really enjoyed everybody coming in and hanging out with me on New Year's Eve. We're running low on mushrooms. Oh well, that'll be enough. There we go. Look at that, just enough. <coughs> All right, now for our anchovies. Woohoo! I love anchovies. Sorry if y'all don't, but I do. Goodness. Mm. Get all them on there. Look at that. Man, my mouth's watering just looking at this thing. And look, there's a couple extra we can eat right now. Mm mm mm. Mm. All right. Man. cheese put the cheese on there just like that put that on there like that and I use parchment paper when I do pizzas and stuff like this on a tray because it seems like it helps them brown a little better than aluminum foil so all right those are ready to go in the oven. Once the oven warms up, I'm going to bake it at 350 for about 15 to 17 minutes until uh, it's melty and goody, gooey. So I'll bring you all back when that's uh, when I, uh, the oven's warmed up and I, after I cook it, uh, bring you back and show you what we got. All right, y'all. I'm going to get this out of the oven. The timer just went off. Ooh. Look at that. That is beautiful. Nice and melty. And uh, I did it off camera, but forgot to say it when I did it. 
I did put some Italian seasoning on the top of that there. Just a little taste, but more for decoration or anything. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and let this cool a little bit for that cheese kind of firms up a little bit. And we'll slice her up and give you all a look at it. All right, y'all. This has been sitting here uh, maybe 10 minutes. I'm going to go ahead and uh, take that one off, set it off to the side so I had some room to cut. Uh, find my knife. Oh, there it is. I'm going to cut into this here. And... Oh, it's good and crunchy. Best thing about this is it has that garlicky bread flavor to it that just adds so much to it. You know, I know y'all dip your garlic bread in marinara sauce, so this is just even better because it's got all the toppings on it. So pull that cheese back up on that one there. So all right, I'm gonna grab one of these suckers off here, give her a little taste, let y'all know what it's what it's doing. And, uh, mm. so good, so crunchy, mm. and pepperoni and the mushrooms, the anchovies, yum, super simple, make this for the whole family, everybody can pick out their own toppings that they want to put on, these are the toppings I like, some people may like pineapple, whatever, put it on there, if you like it, eat it. So, so that's that. That's my garlic bread that I make, or my French bread pizza that I make out of garlic bread. Really appreciate y'all checking it out and hanging out here with me in the kitchen. If you like this, kind of like this recipe here, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, ring, hit that little red button over there that says subscribe and ring the bell. Get all the notifications. Everything we do here in the kitchen, out in the shop out and about tractor pulls whatever really appreciate y'all stopping by and checking it out and hanging out with me hope you try this recipe and hope you really like it and uh we'll catch y'all on the next one whether we're in the garage or in the kitchen here see ya bye